Myself, before I came in the program, I think the easiest way to describe it is just lonely and everything that comes with it. I had completely burned every bridge, uh, nobody to call, no phone to call, nobody to write, um, just lonely. I mean, it comes with depression and everything else, but just being by yourself just has its own toll. My reasoning on coming to the John Vulcan Academy was I had finally had enough. You know, I don't think you hit rock bottom for myself. I just keep digging and digging and digging. And I worked myself into a hole where I was solely by myself. No friends, no family wanted anything to do with me. Um, being an addict and on substances, my body had just had enough. I mean, I was withered up, just weak. Biggest challenges I had to overcome first coming in the program is obviously the first things you think of, no drugs, no tobacco. Uh, another thing I really struggled with was taking direction from somebody and doing what someone's telling me to do. Because for years, I live by what I want to do. You know, if you tell me something I don't want to do, I'm going to leave or I'm going to get my way one way or another. So having to do what someone else is telling me to do was a, definitely a big time struggle for me. The thing I enjoy most about being at a ranch is the quiet. We're out at the very end of town and so you can step outside or have a conversation with somebody and you don't have a loud city roaring at you. It's just nice and peace and quiet and the animals of course. Um, I've always loved animals. I've never been around horses or any of these other big animals so it's cool to be able to work with them and you learn a lot about yourself by doing that too. The most important things I've gained from the John Vulcan Academy, um, I think the most important is self-accountability. And I'm responsible for my actions, and that's something I've never dealt with before. You, know, you could catch me red-handed doing stuff, stealing money out of a purse. Like, I seen you steal it. No, you didn't. I don't know what you're talking about. You know, I turn and run. So being responsible for my own actions and having to man up to them uh, has really taught me a lot. Um, I think just the normal daily routine, you know, what your normal person does every day. Uh, I think it sets the tone for the whole day and kind of gives me goals and through setting goals too is another one you know I still keep after graduating I still keep a goal for the day to complete and short-term goals long-term goals and have a checklist for all those. I'd like to say to the John Vulcan Academy uh, thank you a tremendous thank you I think it's the main reason I'm here and alive today and able to appreciate life for a long time before coming in the program you know, I just didn't really care what happened. I'm 29 years old. I never thought I was going to make it to be this old. And I owe a lot to that to the Academy and to all the guys that are fighting the same fight I do every day. My plans moving forward, I think I have an awesome shot at living a successful life and a happy life. I've had great opportunities thrown at me before career-wise, and I've always seemed to mess them up. I think. Being able to do the mentorship my last two months of the program has taught me a lot and really be able to appreciate a job and ways to keep a job. So upon graduation, stepping into a job, working full time, doing something I know I like because I have a little experience with it, truly means a lot. And I'm just looking forward to being happy and now I can finally do the right thing.